Okay, now it's time to remove your contingencies. You've got a loan contingency, you've got an appraisal contingency, you've got an inspection contingency. You're happy with the inspections. Maybe you asked the seller to spray for termites and it was gonna be $900 and they said, okay, we'll do that. Uh, maybe you, the appraisal came in just fine and you're ready to remove that contingency and maybe your loan is not totally approved yet because of some sort of problem because um, who knows what's wrong, but you need a couple more days. Ask for the extension as soon as possible prematurely if you need to and keep an eye on that calendar. Have your realtor tell you when you have to remove those contingencies so it's not a surprise so they're not calling you say, hey, sign this contingency removal and you get scared. So ask your realtor, if you don't see it on the contract, to point out when you have to remove these contingencies. Now, your contract might call for the contingencies to be removed passively where you do nothing and they just, the contingency is removed and now you've put that deposit at risk or maybe they're active where you have to sign for the removal of contingencies. But be careful and make sure you know what you're doing because again, when you remove the contingencies, you are putting your deposit at risk. So now you've removed your contingencies, everything's fine, everybody's happy, we go on to the next step.